Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. Si Miho Toilet. And for today's video, bibigyan ko kayo ng review ng Get Ready With Me Cosmetics Aqua Tint. So, kung gusto nyo malaman ano yung first impressions ko, what was the wear test review ko, swatches, and my top picks from the product that they released, then just keep on watching. So, kahapon to dumating guys, and I didn't have time to review kasi palubog na yung araw. Nakatulog ako ng tanghali. So, hindi ko talaga siya na-review. Yung ginawa ko na lang guys is ni longevity test ko siya. And mamaya, sasabihin ko sa inyo yung final verdict ko pagdating naman sa lasting power niya. Okay, here are the tints. I just love how clean and simple it is. It's just straightforward. This is a tint. Period. So, three shades yung binili ko. And makikita mo sa kanilang packaging na sulat ng aqua tint. It's 5ml per bottle. So, this one retails for 199 pesos. The shades that I got are um, Millennials, 1993, and PM Scent. So, isa-swatch ko siya sa inyo and let me give you my thoughts about it. Na tayo kay Millennials because that one I already opened. So, this is Millennials. This one is called PM Scent. Ayan siya. So, 1993 naman is leaning towards the brown side. So, ayan ang mga shades of clothes. And as you can see, hindi sila yung matubig na nagra-run. It does stay in place, which is good. And I love that. Ngayon, itry naman natin yung blendability niya over here and start with the same color. So, we have Millennials, like one dot. Yes. What? Insane, diba guys? Like, grabe. You definitely have enough time to blend it out and diffuse it. So, gustong gusto ko siya. So, ayan yung tatlong shades, guys, as a blush or when blended. And these are the full-on shades on my hand. Ayan. So, bago tayo magpatuloy, guys, I just wanna quickly show you the applicator. This actually reminds me of, I think it's Vice. Cosmetics gel tint. Kamukha niya yung ganon. I highly, highly suggest na medyo iganon yung muna siya sa kanyang spopper para hindi masyadong marami yung product na malagay. So, maglagay muna tayo sa lips natin ng Millennials. Kita niyo naman, sobrang konti and ganito kasi ako mag-lip tint. Pagdating sa scent niya and taste niya, meron siya actually. It has a bubblegum scent. Ayan, so medyo may konti akong natikman. <laughs> to be honest, this is always, always the shade that I go for. Pag namimili ako ng lip tints, ganitong-ganito yung timpla na hinahanap ko. It's just a perfect kind of red. And nakaka-fresh siya. Ngayon, out of curiosity, I just wanna put a full-on application. Although, tints are applied like this naman. Okay. Ayan, so it got deeper. Definitely something you can play with and build. Wearing it this way, mas matagal siyang magsustain sa lips at mas matagal din siyang mag-wear off. Bago tayo magpatuloy, guys, let me just talk about the formula itself. Pagdating sa application sa lips, sobrang gusto ko how it covers the entire lips. And pag ginanyan mo yung lips mo, hindi siya tuyo. So if you have dry lips, I think it will be a a lot more friendly than the other tints around. I really, really, really suggest to moisturize first before applying tint. The longer the second coat stayed on my lips, mas nag, parang nag-diffuse siya. So, mas maganda na siya. Yung tipong gusto mo, nasa pagitan ka ng tint at lipstick, ito yon Like, double layer nung um, aqua tint. So, ang ganda. Oh my gosh. If you're asking me if it transfers sa ngipin, merong konti. Ayan. Tikman nyo na lang. Pero hindi naman siya yung tipong nag-pink na yung buo mong ngipin. Hindi naman. Pero meron guys. Meron ng konting lumilipat sa teeth. Kasi nga aqua siya. So it's kind of watery pa rin naman. Kahit hindi siya kasing watery ng iba. So ayan na siya. This is already removed. It does leave a stain. Which is also a nice stain. And for the inner part of the lips, merong nagsistain na konting-konti but it doesn't bother me compared sa iba na parang nandun na lang sila lahat. Ito, meron siyang nilalagay talaga sa top lip and bottom lip. 
Tapos konting gradient effect effect dun sa gitna. So that's nice. So tayo naman ay mag layer ng konting um, makeup sa ating lips. So the next shade that I'm going to try in front of you guys is called PM Scent. So si PM Scent is a burgundy wine. Let's apply this on our lips. Hmm. Now this is deeper and it brings out that natural look in you. Ganun yung feeling niya kasi since it's a lot deeper, parang mas natural yung dating niya. I would say I'm just really really happy na napili ko siya, kinuha ko siya kasi parang no regrets. Magagamit ko talaga siya. And I like this. Huwag kayo kasi masyadong magpa-intimidate guys sa mga plumier shades. Sometimes hindi natin sila kinukuha because it's quite scary. Parang hindi natin bagay. But you wouldn't know unless you try. And look at this. Hindi man nga siya sobrang purple. It's just a deeper color. And it still looks natural. Sobrang tuwang-tuwa ako. And I think I wanna apply more. Yum. Medyo nangungulay siya sa teeth, guys, pag medyo marami kang nalagay. So, inumin nyo na lang. <laughs> so, right now, hindi pa talaga siya nagsiset sa lips ko. It does take a few seconds before it sets. Siguro, mga 30 seconds to 1 minute, ganyan. And this is PM scent on my lips. And if may ka sa dark lipsticks kind of girl, or maybe if you have dark lips, this is gonna work perfectly for you. So, it covers the lips really well. You can switch from a uh, fresh looking tint to a more bolder look. I would say this one has a blue undertone so, so it's gonna make your teeth a lot whiter and it also brings out your skin tone. Alam nyo guys, before we even move on to the last shades, yung super na curious ako, I just wanna quickly say that the longer the color stays on your lips, lalo siyang gumaganda, it really grows on you. I told you na mas prefer ko yung diffuse, di ba? But I'm starting to really appreciate how this one like dries up on the lips. Tintish pa rin yung look niya talaga. Like, it's a lot stronger in color, pero mukha pa rin lips yung lips ko. Alam mo yun, yung parang wala kang pinatong. So, yun yung gustong gusto ko. <laughs> Tumto. Medyo matagal siyang mag-set. So, I'm gonna kiss this. So, ayun siya guys. Little to no transfer once it finally set. Habang tinatanggal ko to guys, let me just show you this one. Itong medyo makapal na layer. Hindi pa ganong tuyo yung basang part. But this one na very manipis siya. Ayan. Hindi na siya gagalap. I'm removing it with a waterproof remover. The more layers you put on your lips, the stainier. <laughs> stainier! <laughs> Mas staining siya. Mas ma and we are down to our last shade. That is the 1993. 1993 is described as brick rosewood. So, meron siyang hint ng brown. May, may buhok. <laughs> meron siyang hint ng brown. And a hint of orange as well. Which I love. Upon checking dito sa mga swatch na ginawa ko, it does bring off that vintage vibe. So, I like that. Try natin siya on a light application. Ang sarap talagang i-glide. Mmm! Wow! I thought it's gonna be super brown on my lips. Pero mukha lang siyang lips ko. But a little bit dark. Ang ganda! Ang natural niya! Oh my gosh! I'm so happy that I picked the shades kasi sinasabi ko sa inyo guys, ito talaga yung mga bagay ko. <laughs> ito talaga yung mga feeling kong bagay ko. So I'm so happy that it delivered. I was really expecting so much and hindi ako nabigo sa expectations ko. And I love the formula. I love the color. Look at this guys! As in, muted! Natural! If you're going for that no makeup makeup look, this is gonna work really well. So this is how 1993 looks on my lips. Natural, maganda, fresh, MLBB. And it's not even dark at all. And I also think you can apply this one as medyo semi-contour blush effect and an eyeshadow base. So yun, ito try natin mamaya yun sa eyes natin. 
But I'm gonna do a double layer now. Let's just let it dry for a while, but the color, guys, I'm in love. Ganda nyo! It just brings out that... Basta, parang may, may ganda siyang nilalabas sa'yo na hindi ko maitindihan. Na parang... Oh. <laughs> this color, guys! Ang ganda talaga. Ang ganda talaga nitong 1993. Tayo naman ay gumamit ng shades as our blush. I'm gonna use Millennials on this part. I did not powder this part of my skin just to show you how it works. As you can see, it actually faded right away. It's a buildable color that you can diffuse. And kahit yan, lagay mo yan dyan, meron ka pa rin talagang oras to work with blending it. And ganyan yung kulay ng Millennials sa cheeks nyo. Yan siya. So, ayan guys, this is Millennials on my cheeks. Nakita nyo naman, walang streak, walang lines, as in faded, beautiful blush. Gusto ko naman gawin dito is, i-powder ko to. Ang tatry nating shade doon is PM Scent. Kita nyo, mas matte na siya. Yes, I'm gonna use PM Scent on this side, just for curiosity's sake. Ay, medyo madami. And now, we blend. Ayan guys, so this is PM scent on the other side of my face. And may powder na sa ilalim niyan. And hindi niya sinira yung look actually. It blended really well. Medyo mas nag-show yung kulay. And hindi siya naging buo-buo, walang namuo. As in, yun, ang ganda. It's still very skin-like. Ayan, so pa-fresh na ako ng pa-fresh. Now we're gonna apply... Uh, 1993 on my lids and I'm pretty sure it's gonna work really well. Apply tayo sa aking lids. Konting-konti lang. Ayan. And maganda siya guys because this is the usual color we put on our lids. Very natural looking. Yung feeling na hindi mo na kailang magdala ng madaming product, this will serve enough. Really feels like a well thought of product. Yung hindi lang siya ni launch just for the sake of launching it. I really felt like talagang, ah, talagang, talagang tinesh siya ng maigi. And I'm really, really impressed. Ayan, guys. So, this is my overall look. I have the three shades of Get Ready With Me Cosmetics Aqua Tint on my face, applied on my eyelids, my cheeks, and my lips. This is 1993 full application when dried. Makikita ninyo na hindi talaga siya lipsticky looking. It still looks like a tint, but stronger in opacity. And I'm so in love, guys. I mean, sobrang money well spent siya in terms of my purchase kasi I didn't buy makeup for quite some time now and I'm so so happy about this product. Sinasabi ko na sa inyo guys, 1993 is sobrang must try guys. Sobrang ganda niya. The fact that this is made with so much passion really really makes a difference anyway when you're gonna ask me about the longevity of the product so if you're gonna apply this on a very light application say yung una kong one swipe only na tint it's gonna last you four hours after eating so the more you layer the product the stronger the stain will be the stronger the lasting power would be so their claim of long wearing works and depends on how much you put on your lips but if mahilig kang gumana ito, na classing person, then it's gonna wear off a lot faster. So, that's just something you need to take note of. So, a maximum of 4 hours for one layer. So, ayun lang guys. I'm just really, really happy with this purchase. You guys should get one of these. This is a great staple. I'm sure I'm gonna repurchase pag naubos to ka agad. And I really, really like it and recommend it to you guys. So, let me know what you guys think about this product. Meron na din ba kayo? Ano bang shade ang pinili ninyo? Let me know in the comments. Huwag na huwag nyo kakalimutan mag-like and also mag-subscribe. Hit nyo rin yung bell button para Making updated kayo sa susunod kong videos and looking forward to more adventures with you guys. See you again next time. Bye!